and welcome to Add More Zest. My name's Rebecca, also known as 4Kids at 147. Happy Fun Cells Friday to you all. Um, so I have a couple of paintings and an off-the-canvas item. You might be able to tell what part of it is, but you won't be able to tell the joy just yet. Um, I'm going to start with the smaller one. So this one is a 30 by 30 painting. Uh, this one I got in round. Isn't she adorable? I just thought it was so sweet. I just couldn't leave those eyes. <laughs> That's what it is. Uh, so it has 22 different colours. The actual size of the diamond painting is short, just short of 25 by 25 when you take off that border. Symbols look nice and clear. Uh, oh, the diamonds are in baggies, which is awesome. There is 310. Um, it is the trees primarily, um, but we do have a few nice little bright colours in there. We've got this bright turquoisey colour. Looks like it goes on some of the leaves. Gorgeous pinks. So yeah, really nice colours in there, but yeah, I just I just couldn't leave Bambi. That's what it was. I couldn't leave Bambi. So that's painting number one. Number two is a big one. So this one is 40 centimetres by 70 centimetres. We have an animal theme going on with these two. Can I get this one out of the bag? This one is not going back in this bag, I'll tell you this now. Oh my goodness me, don't know how they got that one in there. But let's get rid of the bag because there's no way I'm going to fit that one back in. This one, what is it about foxes in diamond paintings? Does it get anybody else the same way it gets me? It's just so striking. So we have... This one is more of a 939 on the background, uh, a mixture of 939 and, where's B? 823. Uh, so more of a navy background than a black. Um, oh, just captivating, do you not think? If I turn this one on its side so that you can see, just look, that tail, those legs, Oh, just gorgeous. And then we've got these beautiful autumn type colours in to complement it all. Uh, this one is 35, it's a smidge over 35 by, let me get it to go straight, just under 65. So take about five centimetres off for the border, but very elegant, um, standing very regal, whereas Bambi is going for cute. <laughs> Bambi's cute, the fox is rather regal. Um, we have some gorgeous butterflies and things up there. We do get the basic toolkit, as we do with all fan cells kits. This one has actually come in the little bags. So the little bags of 200, quite a bit of 939, but look at those beautiful autumn colours all mixed in there. I know we're not quite at autumn yet, but it's getting closer and the weather definitely feels like it's going to be sooner rather than later. But yeah, absolutely beautiful colours in there. So that's painting number two. And then I do have an off the canvas item. I have unboxed things like coasters before, but they just keep bringing out new ones that really catch my eye. And they are so much fun to do. So we have rhinestones, we do have the toolkit, but look at these. Look at these masks. So these ones are on wood. They're all different shapes. And you don't have to use these as coasters. I mean, some of them, yes, they will keep your cup above whatever surface it's on. Um, but some of them aren't huge. 
so even though your cup may overhang I don't think it would still hit the surface but I think these would be much fun for something else so we have all these masks really nice bright colours with the teeth and what looks like glasses but it's probably more eye makeup they're just they're just they're just entertaining is what they are they're entertaining uh so to have a look at the rhinestones with this one get in these uh, so it is all rhinestones. We don't have any DMC numbers with them, but we have your clear or silver. Then we have some black faceted, more like normal diamonds, but then we have yellows, oranges, reds, pinks, blues, just beautiful colours. Oh, we've got some stuff there. Greens pinks and then we do have a few different shades of brown but yeah quite a few different rhinestone colours for that one to keep you entertained while doing your masks I'm trying to get them to fold up into some sort of order to go back in here but yeah they are wooden backs say I'd be tempted to use these as something other than coasters uh, I say you could use them as coasters but I just think they'd be much more fun as something else um, I think I did what did I unbox oh key rings the other day I think if you could find if you had the likes of if you've ever done paper crafts and you have the likes of a cropper dial um is it crop dial? Yeah, crop dial. Sure it is. Um, it's it's basically it's a big hole punch and it will punch through wood. Um, you could turn these into little tags or things like that, or you could pop some sticker material on the back and just turn them into really thick stickers. But you get you get ten. So I think just for the fun of doing those 10 and then using them for something else or indeed coasters if you wish, uh, you could potentially frame some of these. So if it's something like this, um, you know, sort of African style. I don't want to, the decor style, uh, I don't want to say where these masks are based from because I really don't know. Um, but you could frame these in a small square frame and have a series of, say, nine of them. Uh, pick out your least favourite. You could have a series of nine and make it into an actual decor item in your home. So many different things that you could do with them. So even though they come with a coaster rack, I think these have so many other different ways of being used. So yeah, they are my selection for today. We have Regal, we have the masks and we have the cute. Um, I will pop links to each of them down below. Of course, that will not stop you going and having a browse, of course, because there's many new items on there all the time. Uh, but as always, thank you so much to Fansales for sending me these and for sponsoring today's video. And thank you to you guys for watching. Um, it all helps keep this channel going. Um, but yeah, I will speak to you all again soon.